To build our project, we're going to need a couple of data sets. The first one is we need some data in GPX file format. What we're representing here is just anything that's been collected on a GPS receiver and then exported out as just a text file. What we're going to do is search on the internet to go ahead and find one of these GPX files. Once we're done with that, we'll get some stream centerline data and we'll pull that from the NHD Plus website. So we can take a look at how we find both of these. First of all, what we're going to do is we're going to just go ahead and go to Google and do a search. What we're going to search for here is just simply Selway GPX. Now, what we've done, we've searched for Selway GPX, and the first link that we come to, the Kayak Idaho Downloads, this one right here is a perfectly good GPX file we're, we're going to go ahead and use. Now, the Kayak Idaho site is going to require you to go ahead and create a login to be able to download this file. Notice how I've already created a download, and if you look up here, it says, gives me the the option to log out, indicating that I'm already logged in. It also means that I get the option to go ahead and download this. Now, we're going to go ahead and click on the download link, and that'll take us to the place where we can accept the conditions and download the file. This isn't that big, it's about 34 kilobytes, but I'm not going to go ahead and download it again because I've already downloaded this once today. And you can see that if we go ahead and look in the my demo folder, where I have the staging data, notice we have the GPS cellway.gpx. I'm going to go ahead and close this other window so it's not too cluttered. Now the next thing we're going to look at is we need to find the NHD data to get our stream center lines. So we'll go ahead and find the NHD Plus website. Notice how if we search for that, we can go to the NHD Plus home, and on here we can go ahead and click on the data link to find our data. The data that you can download from NHD Plus is organized into basins. And Northern Idaho happens to be in the Pacific Northwest Basin, so that's what we're going to go and take a look at. Looking at this, if you notice, we can scroll down and there's a lot of different data sets we can download. In this case, what we're interested in, though, is the NHD data, which is the third from the bottom here. We can go ahead and click on it. It'll download a zipped archive, and then when you extract that zipped archive, there's going to be a folder called NHD plus 1.7. If you take a look in that NHD plus 1.7 folder, notice how there's quite a few different things in here. Some DBF files, and then if we, in a couple of folders. Within one of those folders, notice there's a number of different files in here that comprise one, two, three, four, five different shape files. So what we have now is a GPX file and some raw data to get started on our project. Before we use them, though, we need to do a little bit of processing to get them organized so they'll work with, with some of the other data that we're going to be matching it up with. But that is the next step.